I asked for an inch. Does this look like an inch off the top of, of my head? Because if this is an inch, then um, I guess I got bad news for myself. Anyways, I got a package in the mail today. I guess we should probably open it, huh? Oh. So I actually know, I know who this box is from. I don't know, okay, all right. I'm gonna mess my desk up. I don't know what's inside of it, but I do know that it is from Lazy Beast. Thank you, Lazy Beast. Love you, appreciate you. Uh, also, welcome to the short hair era. Hopefully it doesn't last. I look like I'm about to fucking enlist in the US military. I'm not. Anyways, more importantly, here's this box. This is gonna lift my spirits. I have no doubt in the world. Woo, some Pokemon cards. What do you think of that, Timo? Look at this. We have a Morpeko V Union. That is so cool. Look at that. It's like the big fuck off card is there and then you can make your own big fuck off card with four cards and there is some boosters. Four, four boosters? Four boosters, cool. There's the back of that box if you'd like to read that. Thank you, Lazy Beast, for this. And then there's one more in here too. A Cyclazar EX box with also four boosters and one big fuck off card. This is, oh, this is so exciting. Oh, and then here's a, here's the note. I don't know if you guys are allowed to see that QR code or not, but enjoy your gift from Lazy Beast. Thank you, Lazy Beast. So I have exactly no idea what boosters are in here or what we're looking for, but I don't really care. I mean, I do care. I'm excited either way. That's the point that I'm getting at. Here's the box again to those that like reading. There you go. Kick it into full throttle with Cichlid. Okay, we got a couple promo cards on the front and let's see. They're always, they're always different. Oh, and here's the code card of the entire box. Will he give it away right now or will he wait till later in the video? Find out in this episode of Cichlazar EX. Pretty cool one right there. Number 18 promo card. Speaking of code cards, we are still filling the effects of uh, Lau and P-Cake in this channel with the amount of code cards that they sent us. And here are about 73,000 more of them. Some of them upside down, most of them upside down, some of them right side up. There you go. A Couple more of those. And here is the code card for the Cyclazar box. The full box, enjoy that. Rotom, a little orange fuck. And here is the absolute bane of my existence. This massive, this card must be an inch big if the amount of hair they cut off of my head was an inch big, long, whatever. Cyclazar EX, big, big one, big boy. Again, I don't really know what to do with these cards. I have so many of them and I don't really know what I'm doing with them. Uh, we've got, okay, this is kind of a fun variety of packs. The Scar, we got a couple Scarlet and Violets and a Sword and Shield Lost Origin and a Sword and Shield Silver Tempest. We're gonna start with the Sword and Shields because I don't like them as much as the Scarlet and Violet. I've really been enjoying the Scarlet and Violet series thus far. Don't know what everyone else thinks, but I quite like them. Another code card for you. This really is the code card episode, as have been the last few. Does anyone use the code cards? Surely somebody does, right? Please tell me somebody does. Jinx would smash. Apparently I'm alone in that regard. Wallace, Venomoth, Growlithe, Pikachu, Pet Lily, Togedemaru, Halucha, Unidentified Fossil, Reverse, and on the end, a Miss Magius, worth quite a bit, I hear. Next, Sword and Shield Lost Origin. Maybe we'll have a little extra luck on this one. If I can even open the pack, that is. We've got a Murkrow, little spoiler right there, a Murkrow. Here's the code card, enjoy that. One, two, three to the front, energy on the back, classic. And we have an Arc Phone. Metacham, Misfortune Sisters, Murkrow, Horsey, Mawile, Shellos, that's cute. Binacle, Malamar, Reverse, and on the end we have, oh, 
a whole lot of nothing, man, a dugong. If I don't pull an EX or better out of one of these sword and shield packs, I will be enlisting in the military. Since I have the haircut now, it should be a walk in the park to get enlisted. Anyways, there's the code card on the back. I don't think we do anything with these. I think we just go through them. Rotom, Palpad, Flabebe, Toxel, Ultra Ball, Espathra, Arvin, Squawk Billy, Reverse, and a uh, Satoddle Reverse, and on the end, a Houndstone, Holographic, guaranteed, by the way, are, are these Holographics in Scarlet and Violet, so, whatever. I'm giving you one last chance, and by you I mean me, please, please, I'm getting fucked. I'm, I, 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 I. Code card, come on, there you go. There's the code card. Uh, Squawkabilly, again. Good to see you again. Capsicid, Alomamola. Pomo, Fortress, Rocky Helmet, Mabostiff, Fortress, Reverse, <whistles> Worth! Wiglet! I hate this fucking Pokemon, but it's cool. Like, wow. The illustration art rares are, I love them. So, okay. Well, I won't be I won't be enlisting in the military is the good news and there's a, the there's a meow scarda scarda on the end holographic. That's cool. Not as cool as this, but okay. This is really where the magic's going to be at in this Morpeko V Union special collection box. That's where it's actually coming in at. We've got about 75 promo cards and we've got himself sealed this box. It seems. I'm hell of a time with this one. Oh, not a clean open. That's okay. That's okay. Come on. <laughs> Come on. We're good. Every okay. Okay. <laughs> All right. I'm not using scissors. I'm not using scissors. My mom didn't raise a bitch. Here we go. Look at all of these. Wow. Okay, so I would assemble the front four to show you what they look like, but why would I do that when I've got this big boy over here? Look at that card. So big I can't even hardly fit it in the front. Is the, is the cut on that fucked up or is it supposed to be like that? It's all like, do you see that? Look at that. There's like writing all around the card. Like every way you tilt it, there's something going on. What the hell is that? Is that supposed to be like that? Maybe it is. I guess it probably is. Well, no, it definitely is because we have these cards that I, oh, why did they put that back? What is this box? This is so strange. Well, there's the code card, I guess. You're getting that early. Um, good luck. And here's a Professor, Professor Burnett on the back, not holographic or anything. It's just a, just a fucking card. I don't know. Why is that back there? That's so odd. I wonder if that is a mistake or if that... If anyone's opened one of these, please let me know. There's the bottom left. They, they're they trying to do Exodia, but this time with a big fucking squirrel. There's the bottom right. Here's the top left. I'm trying to get these out without ruining them. I don't really know what to do with these cards. It's kind of a weird one. Here's the top left. This one's probably the best one because it has the name on it. Again, it, it, I think it's intentionally cut like that, but it... It looks a little stupid, if I'm being honest. And there's the top right. So you can't see, well you kinda can. But we've got Exodia, the big fat fucking squirrel, down here, or rat, whatever that thing is. More importantly, we have four more boosters to open. Couple sword and shields. Looks like we've got Brilliant Stars, Brilliant Stars, Fusion Strike, and Fusion Strike. Don't know what you can get in any of these sets, but here we go. Brilliant stars. Again, I don't know. I don't really know what comes in any of these sets. I don't know much about the sword and shield universe other than, I think I've said this before, but the sword and shield was actually the last um, game that I played on Twitch, twitch.tv slash Hayden on here's one of these. I recently learned, thank you to whoever explained this to me. Those uh, V star cards are weighted so that you can't scam people. 
So you can't buy packs and weigh them and sell the shit ones. So I, 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 I was a hater in the beginning, but that makes sense and fuck anyone who does that. Farfetch'd, ex execute, warm a dam and a muck. A big pile of purple muck. So either the sword and shield pull rates are fucking horrendous or the scarlet and violet ones are good or my luck has just shifted. Uh, one of the 17 different options that has been presented, one of those is true. There's an energy card. Uh, Roseanne's backup. Roseanne can do just about fucking anything if you look at this list here. Uh, Floatzel, Choice Belt, Halucha, Weasel, Ga Gibble, Gible, preaching the word of the Lord, Gible, Trapinch, Cast form, car blast, reverse, and on the end, a god damn, bro, a cleffable, fuck all, nothing. Jesus, dude, come on, man. Something's coming out of the fusion strike pack, one of the two. There's something coming. There is something coming. I can feel it. I can feel it. The Pokemon gods wouldn't let me have a day like this. Not 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 on the same day that I got the most fucked up haircut of 2024. They wouldn't do they wouldn't do this to me. They would they would not do this to me. I know they wouldn't. Are those cards darker? I don't know, maybe I'm, it doesn't matter. Here's the energy uh, on the back. And we have a, I don't even, I don't know what that, what the fuck is that thing? Bro's blowing steam into the sky. Heldegoss, power tablet. Smeargle, that's pretty. Look at all the colors on that little card. Uh, Carvana, Clamperl, Morpeko. Skarmory, Plusle, Reverse, and on the end, a Genesect V. Nothing to to write home about, but uh, it's, it's something. Number 185 out of 264, a, a little silver star. We have one more pack to redeem this day of, of eight boosters with, I guess that illustration art rare was pretty cool. I don't know why it's always Wiglet. I, in the first, the first episode that I ever pulled one of those cards, it was a, just like a boring reverse or holographic or something. I don't remember what it was. Um, but I, I said how much I hated that card. And ever since then, I've pulled just about every, every Wiglet variant that you could get. And so I guess I don't really have anyone to blame but myself. Uh, Simisage, Dancer, Halucha, Totodile, Phantom, Snorlax, Snom. What is Snom doing? Is that his face or his ass? That could be an eyeball or it could be like a like a, a, a hip dimple with the little cheeks right there. Dreepy. Star you reverse. And the last card of the day is a a, a Feraligator holographic. Well, here's what we got today. Nothing too crazy um, besides this. <laughs> Exodia fucking squirrel. There's the Wiglet. I don't know what the value on any of that is. I also didn't tell you the number. 206 out of 198. A secret rare. So decent, I reckon, at least. I don't know. Maybe maybe this maybe this Genesect was crazy and I just didn't know. I don't really know. And a Rodham and a... Uh, these were promos. Uh, whatever. Lazy Beast, thank you so fucking much for sending me these uh, boxes. I had fun. I really needed... I needed a win today after this but whatever uh it'll it'll grow back right that's what grandpa always used to say um and thank you thank you for watching hope you enjoyed this video uh make sure to check out one of these ones here and subscribe if you haven't yet appreciate it and i'll see you in a couple days with another one goodbye